Hi everyone, one minute Tiger Saga. I'm DK. You're a terrible human being. Yes, I am. I just wanted to say that before we get started. Hi everyone, welcome to Otaku Saga. I'm DK. I'm Rizzo. And I'm Zero on Jane Anime Reaction Watch Episode 2 of Ama Ama to Inazuma. Please support the official release. We now return you to your regularly scheduled idiots. Ding! If you want to check out our reaction to the second episode of Amama to Inazuma, hit that link in the description below. And be sure to give us feedback in the comment section because we love hearing from you. As always, if you like what you see, subscribe to Otaku Saga and don't forget to like and share our videos. And, and thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching. On this episode of Amama to Inazuma. Oh my goodness. Um, the, the cutesy faces were on point. Yeah. Um, so basically, uh, the teacher is kind of on the fence of whether or not he actually wants to take his daughter over to the restaurant right. on a, on on a, a regular, regular basis. basis. And I could see why. I can definitely see why because it could be construed as um, something stand. else going on. Don't stand. Yeah, yeah, a certain song by the police comes to mind. Stop it. But yeah, no. Basically, yeah, yeah. It could be construed as a, a little bit more than just that going on. So I can see why he's a little hesitant. Yeah, he doesn't want to overstep his position of authority. Mm -hmm. I believe is the term. Uh, yeah. He, he. I think he mostly just wants to stay out of the situation where somebody else could think that that's going on. But quit your job. Nope. Get a better job. Or get a job that's not teaching. <laughs> <laughs> but uh but yeah, so he basically he decides that he wants to meet with um uh, Katori's mother. Uh which is interesting. Which, yeah. Because when he um, she immediately Oh, she'll be home tonight. Nope. Um I'm Curious as to whether or not she lied. I'm fairly certain she lied. I'm pretty certain she lied. That handwriting and that letter is not really convincing. Yeah, but then on, on the other hand, she also did have that recipe book that was written out. That is true. So, I'm not <laughs> sure. I don't know. It's weird it's all around it's weird yeah uh so in this episode we also found out that katori has a fear of knives and i'm sure that there's some bad deep meaning to that yeah that wasn't just a simple oh i'm afraid i'll cut myself that is a very deeply rooted phobia yeah like that that seemed like a face of someone who's seen one a little too close yeah. Dark backstory. There yeah, she has her. I don't want that dark of a backstory, but I don't know. Yeah. Uh, like that certainly can't the. Yeah, it can't be anything good that causes the tear knives that much. Yeah. So in the end, the teacher decides to go ahead and bring his daughter, you know, to the restaurant regularly for meals. Mm -hmm. Well, she ain't really charging them. Yeah, I mean, why the hell not? So free restaurant meals if you get to cook yourself. I mean, you have an entire restaurant of ingredients. Exactly. I wouldn't turn that offer down for nothing. Nope. I wouldn't either. I would love that. Especially with a girl like shoot. Oh damn it! Like I said, the cutesy face is on point this episode. Yeah. So. That that double team of cutesy face just before the opening. Now the thumbnail. Mmm. Damn it. <laughs> Too cute. Acting cute is not gonna help. <laughs> Making cutesy faces doesn't make it okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, it, it totally makes everything okay. Yeah. But yeah, that's that's about what went on in this episode. Yeah. It that's, was that's it, it was another good episode. It was very relaxing. It helped me 
relax a lot after the previous episode that we reacted to, which was the uh, ReZero episode 15, which was very bad. Uh, more like recover. Yeah. <laughs> honestly. So. I, I, need, I really need I that. I think this series is going to be kind of like what Flying Witch was for us <laughs> last season. Mm, okay. Be where. That's the fresh air. Yeah, it, it just. Uh, so. It could. It could tug at the heartstrings a little bit more, especially if they go in the, uh, into Katari's backstory more. But again, uh, it's a nice I mean, sort really of part one. Of the backstories. That's true. Yeah, because yeah. the the teacher's wife did pass away. That's true. Our main character is a widower. That, so. But I don't want it to get too dark because I did like the feel of Flying Witch. I don't, you know, Flying yeah. Witch didn't really have much backstory to it. It was very no, simple. Not really. Very, it was simple and cute. That was very slice of life. All it was. Nice, I, simple, relaxing family story. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want too much backstory. I don't want too much drama going on. They might throw in a little to keep it interesting, but I think that's pretty much what we're going to get. Nice, heartwarming family story to help us recover from ReZero week in and week out. Yes. But, uh, so let us know what you thought of the anime and what you thought of our reaction in the comment section below. Hit thumbs up if you like it, thumbs down if you don't. But that's gonna do it for this episode of Anime Reaction. As always, I'm DK. I'm Zero. And I'm Rizzo. See, See you, you next time. time. Right? <laughs> that didn't work so well, did it? No. No, you just scared them. You can't be. <laughs>